there, it's Laurel Beard. Welcome to a two minute tip video with Ellen Hudson. Today I'm gonna to be using some salt with watercolors and I'm using the new Hero Arts Liquid watercolors in Deep Ocean and Indigo. These are the two blues that they just released. And here is my salt. I've got your standard iodized salt. This is some pink Himalayan salt. People say it's healthier for you, so I use that. <laughs> and this is some kosher salt. Those have big granules. So I'm gonna be using the pink Himalayan and the kosher salt today. It's funny I have all the salt, I don't even cook. So this is some watercolored cardstock and I applied a wash of clean water and then I'm gonna drop in the color and look at the magic, just watch it go. Isn't that beautiful? I'm gonna take a paintbrush and move a little bit of the color around on that left panel there before we add the salt so you can really see what salt can do with your watercolors. So you wanna make sure that when you apply the salt, make sure it's wet. Don't let your panel dry. So this is the pink's Himalayan salt. It's got the smaller granules and you can automatically see how that watercolor is reacting to that salt. Isn't that neat? And now here's the kosher salt that has the bigger granules and you can see the difference. It's still reacting, but there's not as much of a texture that you're getting there. So then you're gonna go eat a sandwich, whatever, do something and then let it dry. And then when you're done, you're gonna come back and you're gonna see all this amazing texture and it's so cool. So I am gonna take a paper towel and I'm gonna brush all that salt off of my card panel there. And then you're left with the smooth surface, but all that texture from the salt. Isn't that wild? Seriously, you can try this with any watercolors that you have. Totally up to you, but go into your kitchen, get your salt, and give it a try. And maybe I'll use salt for cooking one day. I don't know, but for now, I'm having a great time watercoloring with it. Thanks so much for watching.